Hey guys, today Dad and I headed out to the James River. You have to say it like that. I've been saying it like that since I was old enough to talk. I don't know why. Every time we'd cross over the bridge to go to my grandparents' house, I'd say, James River. So you have to say it like that. But we went to a spot, Dad said when he was a kid, everybody called it Pecker's Beach. I don't know where that name came up from, but that's where we went, and the objective today, if you watched last week's video, um, Bradley's Bite Enhancer sent me their new garlic flavor of their bait spray, and caught some fish on it, and we wanted to try it again tonight, and we wanted to see if it would catch goggle eye. Never used a, a bait spray for goggle eye, we wanted to see if if the garlic would work for that and we also wanted to see I have been using the original Bradley's Bite Enhancer since I think April and we know that it works very well during the summer but we wanted to see if it works for cooler fall temperatures and here in Missouri we've had a drastic change in temperature one day it's 90 the next day it's in the 50s so fish can get pretty finicky when the when the temperature changes that much so we wanted to see if they're not biting on anything else will they bite on the garlic spray and there were people lined up all up and down the bank nobody was catching anything but us so we wanted to test that out just to not just to see if it would work on goggle eye because they advertise it as a multi-species bait spray and we've caught it on or we've caught uh, perch, bass, crappie and catfish on the original spray and last week for the first time when we tried the garlic spray that they just came out with we caught uh, perch and, and catfish so we wanted to see the goggle eye like that because we like goggle eye so we did that. We tested the garlic bait spray out on night crawlers. And then I also I've got a another vintage reel. I didn't even know I had this. I found it the other day and serviced it and got it to working real smooth. It's a Garcia Mitchell 308. They call it the Ultra Sport. Not just an ultra light, an ultra sport. A six pound Berkeley mono on there. Wanted to test that out, and that's what I use today. And this is, um, I we wanted to fish a little longer. We got there, we actually meant to only fish during the daylight hours, but they didn't start biting until right at dark. and they just they kept biting and we wanted to stay longer but I didn't have light enough light for the camera there wasn't enough light for us to see to to tie on new hooks we actually both ended up getting hung up in the rocks and breaking off and we just couldn't see and and it's 50 degrees and it's cold so we headed home but that's what we did today we tested out the garlic bite enhancer and the Garcia Mitchell 308 made in the 50s and uh, hope you enjoy the video. Wow. 
lot nicer than what we had been catching. I said you got a bass and I couldn't get the camera turned on quick enough. What do you want? Do you want to pick her up while I throw it back in? Got it. Now catch his mama. He's a fighting, ain't he? Yep. Hey. What? Yes. Where is your dog alive? Oh yeah. We're gonna eat him. You got spring or you want me to pull this one out? Hey, uh, that's all three species now for me. I'm going to get one. That's a nice one, isn't it? That's two. That's a bass and a goggle eye. Got on this one. Well, Dad's got three species. Finally got the. Got a nice goggle eye to take home and eat. Night crawlers and the garlic Bradley's bite enhancer. What do you think? 
that. Pick up the other one. Is it seven inches? Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I got my worm, Jess. I have three, three fish on one more. Goggle eye number two. My first catch of the night. right as soon as I threw it out there. Got a goggle eye. Very light colored. Like a, maybe a hybrid or something. Tried the uh, garlic flavor Bradley's Bite Enhancer out again today. Um, we were targeting goggle eye and we ended up catching I don't know how many perch. It got, again, it got dark on us and 
we planned on only staying until dark, but that's when they started really biting. So we caught a ton of perch. Um, Dad ended up catching a little bass. And I think we caught four goggle eye, but three of them are big enough for supper. So pretty excited about that. One of them is like a real light color. It's weird, but we're happy with it. I really like the vintage reel that I'm using, the 308 Ultra Sport, and the garlic for fall fishing. I think that really, really helped with the, the goggle eye on the night crawlers. So, there you have it. Tomorrow I'm getting some new lights in the mail for the camera so it won't be so dark so I can actually continue to film after dark rather than trying to use a flashlight. But we cut three eaters and turned back some bass and perch and it works. Don't chance it, enhance it. Well, until next time, best wishes and big fishes.